NASA engineer develops ingenious device to apprehend package thieves in retaliation. The significance of requiring a signature for package delivery cannot be underestimated. Leaving a parcel exposed on your doorstep for an entire day appears to be an unbearable situation until someone decides to relieve you of the responsibility. Surprisingly, the culprits behind these thefts are not the stereotypical hardcore criminals. The true identity of these mail snatchers might astonish you. Having reached the limit of his patience, a man determined not to let porch pirates pilfer his packages any longer took decisive action. He found solidarity in others who shared his sentiments. These ingenious individuals crafted a comprehensive strategy, unafraid to resort to unconventional methods for retribution. A staggering one-third of all packages dispatched to American residential addresses never reached their intended recipients. This isn't due to a malfunctioning postal system, but rather the insatiable greed of porch pirates. Despite their whimsical moniker, their actions are far from innocent. Ironically, it's not the bustling cities, but rather the suburban, rural, and secluded locales that witness the highest theft rates. Surprisingly, North Dakota, a state not often in the spotlight, boasts the highest package theft rate, making its residents 26 times more likely to fall victim. The frustration among these residents was palpable. Predictably, certain times are more opportune for thieves than others. Holiday seasons, for instance, provide ample chances as thieves anticipate valuable gifts rather than mundane online purchases. Given the prevalent theft scenario, you've likely been a victim yourself. Have you ever fantasized about retribution? The masterminds in this story did just that, resulting in a stroke of genius. Alex Armbrister is our first revenge artist and he sweetly recorded the entire process so that we may live vicariously through him. As you can imagine, Alex's packages have been stolen before, often in fact, before he decided to assemble quite a gross package for the next unsuspecting criminal. And he had an unusual accomplice. The first prank begins with a video that has clearly had time and effort put into it. Alex obviously really got into his revenge tape. The video is titled, I'm sick of my packages being stolen. So I got creative and has now been viewed by over 1 million people. It seems that everyone wants a piece of the action, maybe because so many of us have been burned before. The video begins with Alex cleaning out his cat's litter box. He makes sure to get it all, every kitty parcel. He seems to have collected kitty contents for a few days because when he fills a brown package lined with a black bag, there's a lot of it all the way to the very brim. But his creativity didn't stop there. Most impressively, Alex even spent some time making the box look like a very official delivery, going to the trouble of neatly taping it all up. And then he really goes the extra mile, adding official looking accessories such as an authentic looking printed packing list taped to the top of the parcel. There was only one thing left to do. He makes an elaborate video of placing the box on his porch steps, cleverly adding his accomplice cat to the film, watching him through the glass door as he lays his trap. Then the wait begins. It takes a couple of days for the bait to be taken, but taken it is. Captured by his security camera, an unsuspecting man nonchalantly approaches Mark's porch as if he's an invited guest. Brazenly ringing the doorbell to gauge occupancy, he seizes the package and promptly departs. A sense of anticipation fills Mark. The imminent reckoning for this package pilfer is palpable. Typical of many such culprits, this group possessed a shrewd understanding of which residences would receive deliveries. Their tracking method was far from sophisticated. They simply tailed the UPS truck, maintaining a deliberate 10-minute gap between it and them. On the security footage, the UPS truck can be seen trailing them roughly a decade prior. Alex recounted gleefully, expecting a valuable or practical item, the package thief unwraps the sandy surprise after a few days porch rest. Undoubtedly, an unpleasant odor awaits him. Perhaps this malodorous lesson will persuade him to keep his thieving tendencies in check. Nonetheless, not all package thieves experience the same fortune. The next group of people who decided to go sidewalk shopping with a five-figure discount crossed the wrong man. An engineer named Mark Robert created the ultimate revenge box to deter package thieves, and inside was something far fouler than cat litter. His machine is artfully designed to dish out instant karma, and you'll see why. Mark is a former NASA engineer who worked at the Jet Propulsion Laboratory and a nice guy. He doesn't want to see anyone hurt, but he does want to mess up your car interior if you happen to be a porch pirate that is. Mark's prank goes so deep that the technical mastery of screwing up someone's day is absolutely mind-bending. 
He begins with this apparently common problem of people not being able to keep their hands to themselves, and then he explains his elaborate and mesmerizing plan. So, what would you consider the worst way to ruin someone's day without violence, of course? Did you say glitter? Well, that is exactly what Mark thought. Glitter and a certain odor. It took Mark six months, along with help from a friend, to create what must be the most satisfying revenge video for all of you who have suffered at the hands of porch pirates. Not only are the tools used absolutely perfect at distributing glitter to absolutely every nook, cranny, and crevice, but we get to watch it all go down. Mark's video was trending at number three. That's how good revenge tastes. His 10-minute video starts with a lengthy introduction explaining how he built his booby trap designed to douse thieves in glitter and fart spray, of which he says gleefully, one spray will clear a room. And it is named Package Thief vs. Glitter Bomb, unleashing a tornado of gorgeous glitter, followed by five sprays of fart from a can every 30 seconds, it's bound to get reactions. Personally, I slowed it right down to look at the amazing glitter cloud spin and change color over and over again, but that's just me. I think most people would agree that the genius is in the video feedback from every angle, boasting four individual iPhones, each triggered by two latches when the lid of the box is opened. It sets a whole lot of things into action. Mark explains, this custom printed circuit board is the brains of the operation. It has a built-in accelerometer, and when it's jostled, it will check the GPS signal to see if it's been moved from the porch. And if so, it sends a signal to all the phones to wake up and start recording and I'm using four phones that have a wide angle. Ultimately, when they open the package, I just want to celebrate their choice of profession with a cloud of glitter because who doesn't love glitter? He continued, and because the phones have GPS, we created a virtual Juffins around my house, so I get a notification when the package has been moved off the property. And it was not long before that happened. The best part, seeing the footage. So it appears he was walking down the pavement and then suddenly makes a hard left. Then he takes the package and gets in his car and eventually makes it to his garage where the glorious sequence unfolds. Mark narrates in glee. The first worthy victim is a young thief and he was really not impressed, but you can hear in his voice that he knew he deserved it. My car, dude. It's all over my car. It's on everything and the second. The second group doesn't manage to open it properly, so it wasn't so visual, but everyone in the car is yelling too. Throw it out. And what's that smell? Of all the thieves caught out by this fantastic gadget, I think the man shown last is my favorite. He managed to hold in the excitement of opening the package until he got home. As the lid is lifted off, you hear and see the glitter being flung across the room, and he just stands there absolutely still and silently. The device plays a recording. Keep the change, you filthy animal. The dazed man has a look of resignation on his defeated face as he fetches a vacuum cleaner and starts trying to clean up the devastation left by Mark's device of instant karma. A layer of fine glitter covers every surface of the room, and the camera keeps rolling. You almost feel sorry for this hapless package thief. The viral video showcasing Mark's ingenious contraption delivering poetic justice to package thieves has swiftly captivated a wide audience. The remarkable device behind these captivating scenes has struck a chord with countless viewers. There's an undeniable thrill in observing a self-assured porch pirate eagerly unveil their wrongfully obtained spoils, only to be met with a spectacular and unforeseen turn of events.